It's packing time. No, you have to put your arms out for a hug. You can't have him like pushing against me. Anyway, hey guys, it's Kennedy and welcome back to my channel. I'm going off for five weeks to a ballet summer intensive this summer. I'm super excited and we need to get packing. I'm going to my dream school in my dream city, which I'm so excited about because I've been there a lot this year, surprisingly, but I can literally never ever get enough. Like it's like I want to live there when I grow up and it's just such an amazing place. And I've been wanting to go to this ballet school summer intensive for literally ever. It's like my biggest dream and I never thought I would get in, but here I am today, maybe they made a mistake, but even if they did, at least I'm going. Different angle guys, new location because the lighting was really bad. The thing that's different about this year's summer intensive is that last year it was halfway across country and we had to fly there and we also brought like a bunch of suitcases. So that was kind of hard, number one, to fit everything in. And number two, having to store them in my room, like under my bed, it was kind of annoying and didn't really match the aesthetic of my room. This year we're driving there and we're not bringing any suitcases. We're bringing all of these blue bags they're humongous and they have so much space in them and we're only gonna bring like five or six of these bags and it can fit literally everything in there which is super convenient i put little paper in there where we can like label what's in the bag and it's just gonna be so much more helpful because they get big like this and then they collapse down to a tiny little size i don't know how to fold it but like you get the point all right sigmas it's time to get back <laughs> it's time to get packing holly says it's time to get packing High five guys. The first thing that we're gonna get started with is clothes because you know, I can't be naked at summer intensive. So we've got all of the clothes that I kind of want to bring laid out here into like different piles. So like t-shirts, lounge clothes, dresses, bottoms, tops, sweats, dance clothes, all that shebang. But I think the funniest part of this is that I have many tops, many, many, many tops and three pairs of bottoms. So I might need to add more pants in there, but you know, like, I don't think I need to because I can just mix and match, you know, with different things. They're just jeans and like skirts. So it'll be fine. I can sing the baby singing. All right. So this is about the size of the bag. It's pretty big. So I think that I'm gonna be able to fit almost Maybe all of my clothes in there. I think I will be able to. So I think I'm gonna start with dance clothes and you know, I'm gonna go back there and I'm gonna get in that little crevice where there's literally nothing. This is the Holly show. All right, y'all. Why do I always start with all right, y'all? All right, y'all. Okay guys, so I changed my outfit so I could be a little more comfortable. Also the outfit I was wearing before, I'm probably gonna pack it. Yeah, that's the whole situation. But I have everything laid out here and I think I wanna start with shoes. I have three pairs of shoes. Well, actually four if you count my character shoes. I have my ballet shoes and all that stuff in my dance bag, but I also need extra pairs of point shoes. So we're going all the way up to New York and we're going to get them at the shop because they have two pairs waiting for me, which is super cool. Thank you, Gander Minden. Gainer Min, Gain, Gainer Minden. <laughs> anyway, I have my character shoes. And then I have two pairs of sneakers. I have my Converse high tops. I literally love these shoes. And then I have my new Reebok shoes, which are really cute. And I really like them. I tried them on earlier and they are absolutely adorable. I love the pink on them because they have like different colors and stuff. So I think that that's really cute. And then I have two pairs of heels for when we do something formal for like formal activities. So I really love these shoes and they can go with like any color. And then I have these black heels because I have a dress that has like a black little accent bow. So I think these shoes will really go well with that dress because if I think of if I wore these shoes, it would clash too much with the actual dress color. This is the dress right here. Now I think that it's time for dance clothes because I really want to make sure I have those. I think I'm going to put them on the bottom and then everything else will go on top because it is a dance summer intensive anyway. So I'm bringing a lot 
of black leotard because I have dance every day. So I had just this like cute one from Nicolay. This one, I really love this leotard. It makes me feel so confident when I'm dancing. And then I have this Yumiko leotard, also another one of my faves. Just in case I have contemporary, I have black tights, two pairs actually, but we're not quite sure if I'm gonna have contemporary yet because I get my placement class when I get there. And then I have another Yumiko leotard. This one's new. I really like it though. It's, I think it's cute. I like the neckline and just like the whole style of leotard. And then I have two more just normal like Capizio and block ones. And then just in case I want to practice or like for Pilates or PBT or any of those things, they said we can just wear like active clothes or just like normal tight fitting clothes. So I have just like a Lulu top, a Tiger Friday, just black top, another like five top. And then I have two more Lulu tops. And I think they're just good to like wear to exercise either in class or by myself. And then like I said before, I have the two pairs of black tights. Holly is stepping on my clothes and and smashing them and making them all wrinkled. Please stop, Ollie. Anyway, I have two pairs of black tights just in case I get contemporary. I really hope I do get contemporary though. The levels below level three don't get contemporary and it would really be sad if I didn't have contemporary for a whole summer. I'm also bringing a lot of pairs of pink tights. So many packs, these are brand new packs from Mansi. Man, 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 I'm not quite sure how to pronounce the brand, but I love those tights. They're super soft, they're stretchy. And then I have two that are out of the bag. So I'm definitely gonna need those, especially since ballet and technique is every day. Also for point class, they have a rule that we have to wear a white leotard and a white wrap skirt. So I have just a couple white leotards. This one is from Maria, I think. They're just like some pretty basic leotards. I think they're still cute though. Like I really like the back. And this one how it's like crossed like that. Also, we've labeled all my clothes since they recommended us to so we don't lose anything. This is what the label looks like. Just wrote my name on it. Super cutie. My right. mom is on the duty of putting them in the back while I'm handing her things. Even if you don't think you need help, sometimes you need help. You wanna be on camera, mom, say hi. No. <laughs> <laughs> say hi, mom. Hi, mom. <laughs> <laughs> on Saturdays, I think that you can wear any leotard color that you please. So I have this one from Nicolet, and then I have two from Aria, this brown one and this burgundy one. I didn't bring a lot of colored leotards though, so I can just like wash them. And you don't have to wear a colored leotard necessarily. You can wear like black or white or anything like that. I also have these shorts, which are absolutely adorable. They're like the Lulu dupes. I got these off of Amazon and I really like the style. I like the zipper on the back. It's really cute. And they're good dupes for the Lululemon ones. They're good material and stuff. So I got a pair of the black ones, pink pinkish burgundy ones, and then a pair of these blue ones, which I think are really cute. So Holly is resting on my clothes. Hang on, Pookies, we're looking for... I also have some warm-ups here because we're gonna need to go back and forth to class. So I have just some basic trash bag pants. I love these pants just to go over tights or anything like that. And I like how they don't get like stuff on them since the material. I have these pants from Five, which I also love. They make me feel really confident. And then I just have some biker shorts, these other pink biker shorts. That's purple, am I colorblind? Anyway, and then I have the actual Lulu shorts. They're pretty good dupes, right? And then I just have pairs of some leggings. I also just brought some sweatpants that you can, I can either wear to class, out of class, or like in the dorms. I can even wear them going somewhere if I wanted to. They're actually my mom's, but somehow our laundry got mixed up and then I wore these pants and then I've never stopped liking them. I also brought just like one sweatshirt because it's gonna be hot in New York City. So I brought my Juilliard sweatshirt because, you know, SAB and Juilliard share the same dorms and they're both in the Lincoln Center. So isn't it convenient? And it's also my dream college. I wanna go there. I want to go there so badly. And then lastly, I have two pairs of these short, just kind of chill shorts. They're both really soft. These ones are Capizio. I really like those. My mom just bit my dog. She bit me. And then my mom bit her back, which was one of the weirdest things I've seen in a little while. Skirts. Also, here are my skirts. These are the white skirts that I have to wear for point. I have this bullet point skirt, another bullet point skirt, and then I have one more bullet point skirt. So I have three bullet point skirts. There are also black skirts here too, but we're gonna have to locate those by the end of this. I can't see them right now, but we'll find them. Y'all, it's getting kind of full. Uh-oh. Do you think all of that can fit? It's not that much, right? 
It'll find a way. All right, so we got a few more categories of things. We've finished all the dance clothes and warm ups and stuff like that. But now I have got pajamas here, like chill clothes, t-shirts, tops, dresses, bottoms, skirts, and comfy bottoms. So that's basically like my whole closet. Also, I went out today to try to get my nails done today and I had like no outfits to wear whatsoever. But yeah. <laughs> all right, I'll just throw them in there. Got a lot of space. I just felt around the back. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're not cooked. I love this lounge set right here. It is so adorable. It has these little shorts. And then look at this top. Like, come on. That is adorable. I love it so much. So I'm definitely gonna bring that. We're cutting it close. We're cutting it close. And then I have just uh like probably like five or six more pairs of lounge sets just so we can be safe, you know. Action! Uh, why did your voice? Action! You sound like creepy best than Justin Bieber. <laughs> but anyway, I forgot that I went to the store and I bought some new color leotards. These are so adorable. They're from Sudansa. And I love the cut of them. They're high cut. And I love the colors. I like this green color. I think it's cute. It's like a forest green. I'm gonna just stuff it in there. And then I have this purple one, which is the same style, just a different color. I also got more point shoe ribbon and elastic which is good because we're going to need that when we sew all of my shoes and have a sewing party the night before I have to move in. Point shoe party! Ow. Ow. Anyway, I have brought so many tops because, you know, it's summer in New York and I want to be cute. This top is so adorable. I love this shirt and it fits really well too. So I have all those tops and I think that this is actually going to take up the most space in the bag. The bag might not think we can do it, but I think we can do it. And also I have my cute little, cute little jelly cat my best friend got me. It's coquette and it matches the vibe I'm going for in my room. This is gonna be a good summer. I feel like I'm gonna, get, I'm, I'm gonna improve a lot this summer and I'm really gonna push myself and work very hard in class this summer because I really want to see a lot of improvement, especially in ballet. <sighs> Last two categories. We've got t-shirts, so I got like little baby tees and just like t-shirts I can wear like to bed or like around the dorm. I think we can do it. I think we can do it. We got two more items. Literally just two pairs of pajama pants and these linen pants. Look at the back. Look at this. It is overflowing P H A T fat. Maybe if you tuck them on the side there. Hold them up like little, like little hot dogs. I'm gonna attempt to zip everything up. Oh God. All right, we're gonna start slow, you know? Okay, that was good, that was good, that was good. Let's do this side. She is biggie. I'm gonna make it work. This is gonna work! I'm using all of my strength for this. <laughs> I finally got her clothes. So now we're gonna do the heavy check. Um. another one of these blue bags that I'm just gonna dedicate to all of my toiletries. So like hair stuff, toothbrushes, makeup, skincare, all of that kind of stuff. I actually have some stuff in this blue bag right now, like this case. Look how adorable this is. It's gonna carry all of my hair stuff. We already have some stuff in here, but I have so many pockets to fit full size items in there. We're gonna pack it later because I'm gonna need my toiletries until we leave because it's only Thursday and I leave on Saturday. So that's basically our plan. A full packing list will also be down below in the description and links to the products will also be there. Oh, and I'm also gonna bring more stretching equipment like yoga blocks and like a yoga mat and stuff like that. I already have like some TheraVans and stuff in my dance tote bag. Make sure you check out my what's in my dance tote bag video. I'll link it in the description. Give it a like maybe. So. Let's go downstairs and see all the other stuff we've been packing because we've been packing for a couple days now and we've got everything in there. Come on, let's go. Just a warning, these blue bags are not very aesthetic. It looks like I just robbed a bank. I promise I didn't. 
my whole room is gonna have this coquette, very like hyper feminine vibe. So just to show you some of the stuff, I've got all of these like pink hangers with like rose gold at the top. I've got like a water bottle cleaner and stuff because that's pretty essential. I've got like a laundry bag and then I have like my pillows and stuff. And then in this one I have like my bedding and stuff. And I also have like command strips and sticky tack because they said that we can hang stuff on our wall if we use sticky tack so it doesn't like damage the paint or anything, which I completely understand. Also, I have these little like sticker cards. Holly's eating our carpet. Look what she did. Holly, no. She's a bad No, girl. no, no, no. Bad girl. These are some of the cards that we have. I love this one. I love swans. Swans my favorite animal. Okay, and this bag, she is also P-H-A-T, fat. So I'm gonna try to unzip her and see. But in here, I've got these super cute pink towels. I've got these sheets. Literally look at the print. It's adorable. I love them. And then also I think they have pillowcases in there. And I also have these silk pillowcases because you gotta protect the hair at night, you know, because some pillowcases rip out my hair because they get like stuck to the pillowcase at night. Oh yeah, bedding's also in there. But then I've got, I'm not quite sure what this is. What is this? A laundry basket. Oh yeah, that's my laundry basket. So I'm so sorry guys, I'm so clueless. <laughs> okay. You see those muscles? They're actually like non-existent. That's literally just a tendon that I'm flexing right now. This bag is where it gets really interesting. I've got a lot of random and odd things in there that they said to bring. An umbrella, a steamer, trash can, a big ice maker down there. I hope I didn't just break it because it sounded like it was cracking. And then more hangers and stuff. These skirts are cute. and stuff. For skirts, that's cute. I love that. Last year, my room was absolutely mess. Things were all over the floor. It smelled like mold. It was absolutely embarrassing. I think I was just a little too excited to be away from my parents. I don't know what was going on. But I told my parents that I promised I wouldn't mess my room up if everything matched the aesthetic. Also, this is a drying rack. This is also pretty cool. And it works really well. I used it last year at Summer Intensive and it worked pretty good. <laughs> I'm gonna need help with this. I also have this first aid kit that's just like an emergency small, emergency, emergency small little kit. So I've got like band-aids, sun bum sunscreen, toe tape, Tide pens, medicine, Clorox wipes, just all the stuff, a thermometer, just all the stuff that I might need and hopefully not need during the summer intensive because I'm gonna hope I don't get any injuries and I'm gonna hope that I don't get sick. Finally, in this final bag, I just have a bag full of snacks that I'm probably gonna need. So I have like, Water, Pringles, huge popcorn at the bottom, mac and cheese just in case they serve a meal that I don't necessarily like because you know, I'm a very picky eater. So sometimes I don't like, actually all the time, I don't like a lot of food. <laughs> Up here we've got random stuff that we still have to put in the bag. So like extra two pairs, oh, two pairs of extra ballet flasks because the ones that I currently have are crusty, dusty, and musty. And then an extra pair of point shoes, literally just in case. This also isn't the type of point shoe I wear. This is a completely different brand. But these are just a backup, just in case something happens, which I hope nothing happens. And then I have these socks. They're for contemporary, just in case I have contemporary. So thank you guys so much for watching episode two of my Bally Summer Intensive Diaries. A lot of new content is coming soon and it's being planned currently, like travel there, move-in day, dorm tours, morning and night routine while I'm there. So stay tuned for that. And if you've stayed till the end of this video, comment blue bag in the suitcase emoji. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe. New videos coming out every single week. And I will see you guys next week. Bye-bye.